In this video, I'll show you how to build a fast and easy bamboo farm. So first, make yourself a 17 by 2 platform. Then place two blocks in here, take out your chest and a hopper and place the chest in here. Behind it, break the block, crouch and right click the chest with hopper in your hand so it will connect. You can test it out by throwing an item inside and if it goes inside the chest, it works, it's connected. On top of the hopper, place a power trail. Once again crouch while you place it. So a power trail, normal rail and 10 power trails all the way on this side and in here let's place two normal rails and go with power rails all the way back in here. Now let's power the rails on. So go here in the middle, break two blocks and place two redstone torches. Now as you can see all the rails are powered. Now place a redstone comparator back in here pointing in the hopper. Then behind it a block Redstone repeater on top and then a redstone torch behind it and once again a block on top. And now make sure it looks exactly like this. Now if you throw an item inside the hopper, the rail will turn off. Which means when the hopper minecart goes around, it will stop here, empty itself and once it's empty, it will start moving again. And now take out some grass or dirt and place it above the rails all the way around on top. Now let's take out some building blocks and go one block up. Don't place blocks here in the corners. I mean you can do it but you'll just save some blocks if you don't do it. Then go all the way around. Like so. Now let's take out our peach stones. Our observers and some redstone dust. Go up here, place pistons on both sides. Get some blocks here on the sides as well. And then place blocks once again behind the pistons, both sides. And now above these pistons, let's place observers like so. So place a observer on every other block. The same thing on his side. Then place some blocks in between the observers. If you're gonna build this underground, replace these blocks with some glowstone or jack o' lanterns or any light source block. Otherwise, the bamboo won't grow underground. Then redstone dust. Once again, both sides. Now take out your slabs and place them up here. The reason why we place slabs here is so mobs won't spawn on top and drop down in slice of farm. Then take out your bamboo and your glass blocks. Plant down the bamboo down in here on top of the grass or dirt. And now you can test this out if you'd like to. So place two bamboo here and yeah, as you can see it works. Same thing on both sides. Now go up. The easiest way to go out is to just break the wall and rebuild it so you can get up here. And now take out your glass blocks and place them up here. The reason why we place glass up here is because bamboo grows up quite quickly. And if it goes over the board, let me demonstrate, sometimes the bamboo can get stuck up there, as you can see. So that's why we place the glass in here. Then lastly, take out a hopper minecart and place the hopper minecart in here. And once it comes back, it will drop down all the bamboo inside this chest. As you can see, it stops, bamboo goes inside the chest, and once the hopper minecart is empty, it will start moving once again. You can also take a lever and placed in here if you ever want to stop the minecart, but this is not necessary. I left the farm running for 10 minutes, and yeah, quite a lot of bamboo. 
and with his farm is running on the background, that chest will get filled quite quickly. What a nice, fast and simple farm. So anyways, my name is Kaymond, thank you so much for watching, if you liked the video, hit the like button, subscribe, and watch this video next. I'll see you in the next one.